Hello everyone and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today we're looking into Taurus's weekly guidance message for this upcoming week. In this message, Taurus, we're going to tap into the energy surrounding you this week. We're going to see what's challenging you and where this is headed if you stay in this energy. I'm going to clarify throughout the message. I'll pull a few cards at the end for advice moving forward. If it's something you're interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. Also, guys, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome here, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So let's dive in here, Taurus, and see what we can see for your upcoming energy for this week. Most important message here for Taurus, Spirit, what do my Taurasian friends need to know? Like there's something here that you intuitively know it's time to take action on but I feel here you're kind of slow at getting things started in the right direction high priestess eight of wands page of wands we're going to clarify all of this in a minute I'm going to say for a lot of you this is going to be a move or some sort of change in your personal life okay the challenge here is there's a lot of conflict there's a lot of chaos I feel like for a lot of you this may be like quitting a bad habit like quitting drinking or something along those lines what I feel here Taurus is coming out is this is kind of your release in the moment it's a way to cope with life's daily stresses to deal with the conflict the drama of life and so that's why you're having a hard time letting this go doesn't necessarily have to be an, a drinking issue a drinking um shift okay shift in in what you intake uh, this could also be like shopping or focusing too much on work um, but I feel here there needs to be more of a balance is what I will say. Okay. Taurus, I do feel like there is a lot going on in your life right now. You have the Ten of Swords, the Eight of Cups, the Five of Pentacles in the outcome. And we're going to clarify all of this right now. But I feel like because of something that you're walking away from in your present energy, that's going to need to be completely released before you can work on this behavior pattern shift. Or this other change okay so let's clarify for you now if you find the messages helpful or resonating please give it a thumbs up also guys if you like the vibe how I interpret the cards you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel we're gonna start here by clarifying the high priestess the eight of wands the page of wands for Taurus's energy please and thank you what do my Taurasian friends need to know Five of Swords, Eight of Wands. So again, a lot of conflict that you're trying to release. A lot of you, this may be an ending of a difficult relationship. And maybe this isn't just a romantic partnership. Maybe this is an actual friendship. I feel like this person that you're distancing yourself from here, Taurus, is causing a lot of chaos, a lot of stress. And even though it's difficult to walk away, I feel like that's where your happiness, happiness lies. That's where your stability lies. So what I see here, Taurus, is it's time to move forward. Trust the process here. So let's pull a few cards out here for your advice, guidance, moving forward. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. I definitely feel here, Taurus, with the Queen of Cups, the Page of Swords, the Three of Wands, and the Ace of Swords. There's a need to make a plan and be strategic with your next move moving forward. 
especially if it's walking away from a particular person. You want to protect your energy. You want to protect your surroundings. Take care of yourself, your needs. Um, the Page of Swords tells me that there's watching. Uh, watching, lurking, waiting. So be mindful of this energy. Okay. Uh, again, making a plan is going to be key here moving forward. Being strategic. Let's pull a soul truth message to sum up your reading. I do feel like you are headed towards happiness. You are headed towards stabil stability, <laughs> towards healing. And so trusting the process, having patience with yourself through the process is going to be important here. So Taurus, your soul truth message is what if it isn't true? The thing you are telling yourself right now, the concrete reason why you think you don't belong, you can't do it, you won't get there, you're not enough, or it's not for you. What if it wasn't true? Today's soul action, it's time for a soul chat. Close your eyes, put your hands on your heart, and ask the wise one within you, what if it isn't true? What else might be possible? Journal your answers. What lie do I need to let go of to reach my soul's truth? Beautiful, beautiful. So Taurus, I feel like that's a good solid message coming out for you guys. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. Again, if you want to get in on a personal reading, the information is all below. Otherwise, thank you guys again, and I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.